right now. Uh, Sumit sir, can you please switch on the recording? So good evening, everyone. First of all, thank you all for joining this session at such a short notice. I'm Ishika Sinha, your GDSC lead at IIIT Bhopal. Today we have our, uh, our cloud facilitator, Sanskriti Saraswat, with us. She'll be sharing all the information regarding 30 days of Google Cloud with you. Over to you, Sanskriti. Uh, you are muted. Oh. Thank you, Ishika. So good evening, everyone. I'm Sanskriti Saraswat the GDSC cloud lead and your cloud facilitator. I will be guiding and helping you through this new and interesting journey in cloud. Remember, you can always ping me if you have any doubts. So from here, let's start our journey with scopes and opportunities for Google Cloud. As you can see, the scope of Google Cloud computing is very bright. Surveys tell us that the cloud computing market in India is at $2 billion and is expected to grow with an annual rate of 30%. There is a tremendous increase in cloud adoption and demand for resources for skilled workers who can fulfill this requirement. Many companies have moved to the cloud to manage their products successfully and scale their products. In the last three years, there has been more demand for cloud professionals by 33%. Comprehensively trained cloud organizations are nearly three times more likely to achieve their innovation goals. Cloud skills are high in demand. Hence, cloud adoption continues to grow. Isn't that great? Now that you know about it, let's quickly start with what you've been waiting for. Let's look at what we have for you and what this 30 days of cloud brings. The first question which comes is what is 30 days of cloud? Well, the 30 days of Google Cloud program will provide you an opportunity to kickstart your career in the cloud and get hands-on practice on Google Cloud, the tool that powers apps like Google Search, Gmail, and YouTube. Along the way, you will learn and practice concepts like computing, application development, big data, and machine learning using the cloud, and if you get stuck, I'm always here. The next question which appears is why you should join it. For that, you will gain hands-on lab experience by actually working on Google Cloud Console using Quick Labs. We'll be talking about Quick Labs as well. You prove your in-demand skills by completing the labs and challenges which we will talk about. And finally, you will be able to share these accomplishments on your LinkedIn profiles and resumes as well. And this is not it. Now let's look at the content. We have two tracks, the cloud engineering track, and second, we have data science and machine learning track. Okay, so the first track we have is the cloud engineering track. We have six quests here. By completing all these quests, you will be learning and exploring to deploy solution elements, including infrastructure components such as networks, systems, and application services. Let's look at the second track. For track two, we have data science and machine learning track. By completing all the quests in this track, you will be able to learn and demonstrate proficiencies in topics related to big data and machine learning to prepare for roles such as data analysts, marketing analysts, business analysts, and data engineers. At the end of each challenge or quest, you will earn a skills badge. So all you need to do is pick your quest, complete the challenge lab, earn a Google Cloud Digital Badge, and share your skills badge on your profiles. Take a look at the video. Are you looking to build and showcase your cloud skills? Want an easy way to show them off? You can now earn skill badges from Google Cloud to demonstrate your growing cloud competencies. Here's how it works. First, you need to join the Google Cloud Skills Challenge. This gives you 30 days of free access to Google Cloud Labs. Then, choose the track you're interested in and get started. Each track has a number of skill badges up for grabs. To earn a badge, you'll need to complete a series of Google Cloud Labs. Then, 
you'll need to pass a final challenge lab designed to test your skills. Once you've earned a badge, showcase what you've learned. You could add it to your resume and share it with your network. Ready to go? Join the Google Cloud Skills Challenge today and start earning your skill badges. Okay, you find it nice? So from here, let's look at the campaign schedule and timelines. The student registration starts on 22nd September 2021 starting at 5 p.m. sharp. Please note that there is no end date to it, but the registrations will close as soon as 50,000 registrations are completed. So you can consider the limit to be 50K. Another important note, don't think that it will take, you know, days or two to fill up these forms. There is no such case. Fill up the form as soon as you receive it and grab your seat. After this, the cloud campaign will start from 27th September, 27th October. And during this one month, you will get sessions, study jams, and you have to complete the quests to earn your rewards. The drive completes on 27th October, and all the swags and prizes will start getting delivered from 27th November. Now you will all need an environment to practice these labs and quests that I have been talking about. So for that, we have our Quick Labs. It is a hands-on learning platform for those who want to become more familiar with operating cloud environments and writing applications that run on them. You will get hands-on Google Cloud Console itself. So the process is very simple. Once the registration forms are open on 22nd September, sign up in the form quickly. Remember the limit of 50K. Once you have successfully registered, you will be getting an auto response as a confirmation for your sign up and also the quick lab link which you can use if you have an existing account already please create a new account for this task because progress will be recorded from 27th september to 27th october for all the prizes and if there are any changes or updates in this i'll circulate them with time now coming to rewards for participants what do you what do you get on completion well, if you complete track one or track two, that is any one track, you get a t-shirt and a sticker sheet. And if you complete both the tracks, you get a t-shirt, a sticker sheet, a laptop bag, and a zipper. Isn't it really fascinating? So well, this was all about the registration process and today's session. We will be having more sessions like this. And I really look forward to most of you for joining this 30 days of Google Cloud. Please register as soon as the registration form is available. Don't wait for you know, any timely delays. Just fill it as soon as you get it. Any questions? Uh, Sumit, sir, can you please enable the mics? I have allowed the mic for you, Nikhil. You can ask. Uh, thank you, much, sir. Uh, just a trivial question. The links will be received on the email, right? Yes, they will be received on the email. Thank you very much. That will be on 22nd of this month. Yes, yes, day after tomorrow at 5 p.m. Okay, thank you. There is something in the chat to Sanskriti. Yes, sir. Okay, uh, Priyank, there is no such thing. All you need to do is just fill the form and keep in mind the 50K limit. 
as soon as you get the link. But yes, if you have already an existing account on Quick Labs and you have some credits and you have done the labs already, then it won't be recorded. You have to create a new account and start fresh. Abhishek, your mic is active now. Uh, so this is Abhishek. Um, my question is that uh, one friend is there in CIT Bangalore. Uh, he said that uh, their uh, link is being changed um, tomorrow. No, no. I uh, recently got an email and they said that it won't be circulating on 21st. It will be going on on 22nd. There was a change in plan. Okay, okay. Thank you. Okay. 